I wake up brutally early, usually 5.30. The lights hit me, old habits die hard. Roll out of bed, chug a bottle of water, and then I meditate. Mornings are my me time. It's before I run into the space and get trampled and swarmed with people and things to do. I like getting up early before everyone else when the world is quiet and focusing on myself. You can't take care of other people if you can't take care of yourself. And when I'm centered, calm, and ready, then I'm ready to go lead our accelerator. I then maybe make some tea, make my bed, read a chapter of a book, completely without checking my phone, and then I get ready to go work out in the morning. I don't eat breakfast, and I go straight to hit the iron. So, welcome to this beautiful building. This is where we host the iVenture Startup Accelerator over summer. It's huge, it's gorgeous, it's open, and it's a perfect spot for student entrepreneurs to work on their ventures. So, we like to start off every day with an iVenture adventure. And the whole purpose of this is to either bring energy to the space, get people to know each other, or build camaraderie. So a big part about iVenture is the community. We depend tremendously on the time that's donated to our program from local community leaders and investors and alums. So we actually give out free lunch, so come visit us and help out our teams. So let's go get lunch. Oh wait, check this out. It's a nice magazine. Center page, let's see what's in the center page. Oh wait, that's pretty cool. Let's go get some lunch. I'm really busy because I'm greeting everyone, make sure everyone's comfortable, and always make sure our students eat first. Sometimes when I come to lunch, lunch is gone. So that's why I have my awesome desk with my personal food to make sure I get through the day. But the main point here is that people are always watching you when you're in a leadership position, especially students. And I'm never the first person to eat. Uh, I'm always dressed professionally, so like I wear a suit and I have fun with them. But the whole point is like that I take this job seriously and I'm here to help people and setting a standard that other people can be like, oh, okay, like Manu shows up the time, Manu does the work, Manu is, you know, coming here and putting in 100%, then hopefully that rubs on to the people as well. So we're at my desk, I like to call this the back cave. It's just like a solitude, going through the entire place. There's always people, students, things going on. So if I need to get stuff done, I come here. So being into health and fitness, taking care of myself. We have a book from one of our teams that focuses on the online education space. These guys actually went into Shark Tank and turned down investment and joined our program. So they're a weight collar for barbells. Ernest Earth, they're producing fertilizer and I potted plants using a fertilizer. And this team, they're a mobile app for car enthusiasts and they just got into tech stars. So I like to keep these things around me. And oh, you know, magazine, books, stickers. Beautiful view, this is where I stick around to do the work uninterrupted and unobstructed by other people. As you can see, the day is tremendously busy. There's people coming in and out, there's a lot of things happening, and we have tons of student teams. We're about two weeks away from demo day right now, 
What that means is teams will be actually presenting their ideas to some of the biggest entrepreneurs, investors, and leaders in the state of Illinois. So I got to spend a lot of time one-on-one -on -one with the teams to make sure they're prepared, answer their strategic questions, and make sure they're all set, not just for the summer, but for the future and what they plan to do with their venture. So come on, we're going to go upstairs to the beautiful Eagle's Nest and we're going to actually talk to some teams. And we call this office hours. Without a doubt, this is the coolest program and I have the coolest job. Every day is different. I wear so many hats. I could be managing our program fellows. They're not interns, they're fellows. I treat them as colleagues. And I can go from overviewing marketing strategy, design strategy, operations questions, and then to doing strategy with actual startup teams. Talking to teams that, and individuals that might need some motivation or they're feeling down. Maintaining energy and culture, sometimes that means throwing a frisbee or cracking a joke. Keeping everyone focused, you know, it's 50 individuals, we've got 10 weeks to present our progress to some of the top people in the state of Illinois. So I really love what I do and I'm fired up every day I come here. I'm here early morning and I'm out pretty late. But despite all the challenges, obstacles, and things to do each day, I leave every day and I come in every morning with a deep sense of personal satisfaction and gratitude because I really get to play a small part in hopefully what it is a career defining and personal life defining moment for a lot of these young people. And I really do believe that a lot of them, and a lot of them have gone on to change the world and really pursue their dreams. And that's super, super cool. So a big part of why this program is so successful is that we treat students as adults, and we don't talk down to them, and we work alongside with them and incorporate their feedback into what we do. So our fellows, including the one filming this, Joe, is not just an intern or a fellow, he's a colleague and a friend. See you guys. <laughs>